Well, I used to work in oils, and oils are what I call a very macho medium. They do what you tell them to do, no more, no less. And as a result, there are no surprises because they do what you tell them to do. Watercolor, on the other hand, is very feminine, has a mind of its own. And you don't control it so much as you learn to dance with it. And as a result, it's like a marriage. You know, it's full of surprises, and it catches the joy, the excitement of that kind of relationship with the medium of watercolor. For example, uh, the one above it uh, called Eighth Day of Creation. Uh, to title that uh, landscape uh, trees and a lake is insults your intelligence. You can see that. But when you title it in a way that draws the viewer into the conversation about why did you paint that as opposed to something else, Eighth Day of Creation catches the amazement that we are living in a world that is constantly evolving and being created and recreated. So titling, I think, draws that uh, viewer into the conversation that art has to offer.